God, through Joshua, read them the history. Now, beloved, the Israelites are in a position to make the crucial decision. And so the question is this morning, will they get it right? <laughs> As very our theme for the month is faith and family, because every family needs to make the decision to have a strong connection to the faith. See, I know all of us have our challenges, but the family needs the faith in order to keep it together. You don't need a game of spades. You don't need generational curses. You ain't got to sit around the table smoking and drinking. But you can sit around the table praying and thanking God. I'm so sick and tired of families passing down one generational curse, one generation to another. Just because your mama had bad relationships does not mean you can have bad relationships. Just because your father went through hard times does not mean you're going to have the same hard times. Just because your grandmama and them had grumpy attitudes against the church does not mean you're going to have grumpy attitudes against the church. You need the faith to keep you together. Since you don't have any money, you still got faith. When all your supporters and fans get missing, you still got faith. When you ain't got no followers on Twitter, you still got faith. When consistent failures happen in your life, you still got faith. But in order to have faith, you must make the decision to serve God and not your emotions. And at verse number 15, our main verse on the day, Joshua showed them what they needed in order to make the decision. Tell me to make a decision. Make a decision. He said in verse number 15, choose ye this day. Because, beloved, you had enough opportunities before. Mm -hmm. You did what you wanted to before. Mm -hmm. Now it's time to do what thus saith the Lord. Yeah. No turning back. Choose ye this. Yeah. 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 Joshua then provided one more reminder as Barry when he said, watch this y'all. The God which your father served that were on the other side of the Euphrates River or will you choose the gods of the Amorites in whose land you now dwell. Mm. Okay, I caught that. Mm. This means Asbury, you will choose the God who blessed those before you, mm. you before you got here, or will you stand in fear of the God of your enemies? Mm. Finally, Joshua says, no matter what you do, Israelites, as for me and mine, right. hey, we will serve the Lord. Yes. If you read that carefully, as very Joshua gave them a choice, but really he didn't give them a choice. He gave them a choice by presenting God as the option, but then he didn't give them a choice by making God the priority. Let me help y'all out real quick. Then. Growing up, my daddy used to make liver and onions, and I hate liver and onions. So he told me, you got two options today. You're going to eat liver and onions, or you ain't going to eat at all. What Joshua told them. Uh, you either want to serve God in this house uh, or you ain't going to have no house to yeah. serve God in. Uh, right. See, Joshua is the leader uh, and he's making the declaration uh, that all who are in my house uh, are serving God uh, and God alone. Uh, the beloved, there really is no option. Uh, don't give me your excuses. Uh -huh. Don't tell me what you will and will not do. Uh, if you are with me, uh, then you are serving God, uh, the God of Abraham, uh, the God of Isaac uh, and the God of Jacob. Uh, if you're in this house, uh, then you will worship the God uh, who has brought us uh, this far by yes. faith. Uh, do me a favor. Ask your neighbor uh, whose side are you on? Uh, see, you gotta understand today. Uh, you gotta make the decision uh, to be on the Lord's side. No, you can't sleep in on Sunday. Uh, you can't miss service uh, to go over to your boyfriend's house. Uh, you can't chill and watch the game. Uh, you're either here uh, or you're nowhere at all. Uh, see, I can't be indecisive uh, about my God uh, because he's been too good to me uh, in order for me to hesitate about him. Uh, he's been too kind uh, so I won't stutter step. Uh, he's covering me uh, so I know where my loyalty is. Uh, there's no doubt in my mind 
I will serve you.